This is again Subaraj Zara Technical Center here at the Government Technical Institute at Wilford Avenue, Georgetown. At this modern state-of-the-art facility, hundreds if not thousands of students will be able to access much-needed technical training in new modern facilities. Now this facility was constructed at a cost of $200 million. $20 million were contributed by the Ministry of Education, while $180 million were contributed by an overseas-based Guyanese, Ken Subraj. Mr. Subraj said he's not a man of many words, but he had this to say as he commissioned this facility and handed it over to the Education Ministry. Education Minister, the building is yours. Make full use of it. This facility boasts several modern facilities. It has several multi-purpose classrooms and a special oil and gas classroom and laboratory. According to President Dr. Irfanali, such modern facilities are necessary so that Guyanese students can be better equipped to help contribute to the transformation of the country. What Mr. Ken would have contributed to is not just the building of a building. Sometimes we get carried away that it is about the physical structure and we cut the ribbon to physical structure. It is what this structure has the potential to create. It is what this structure has the potential to transform. It is the value added that will come as a result of this structure. Yeah, it is that value addition. It is that wealth creation. It is that opportunity creation that the building catalyzes through what will be done inside of the building. And that is where the value proposition goes up. And, and that is why in congratulating you, it goes far beyond the physical building can. Meanwhile, the Minister of Education, Priya Manik Chan, said though this facility costs some $200 million, its value can't really be measured. I know institutions like these have the, uh, the capacity to change lives change generations, change the trajectory of families. And so that's why we partnered with um, the Ken Sobraj Foundation. I can't think of a better way to spend your earnings or resources, but through education. The education minister also noted that this brand new facility will complement her ministry's efforts of expanding technical training all across the country. According to her, six other facilities will be established in other parts of the country. Reporting for the newsroom from Wilford Avenue in Georgetown, I am Fishani Ragabir.